Hello, I'm Andy and I'm going to read a weekly horoscope for you that's from Sunday the 12th of February until Saturday the 18th of February and that's for you coming from Gemini. Now, let's start with Sunday the 3rd. This is going to be a difficult day for you and it's going to be difficult in the sense that others are going to be very provocative and you may lose your self-confidence on uh, Sunday the 12th Try to lie low, meaning don't want to also show your temper or show your daringness. And that way, Sunday the 12th, morning and afternoon sessions, which are not going to be very happy for you, and attacks come from others, things said about you in your area of marriage and area of romance are going to be very disturbing. So you cannot afford to be pushy or stubborn or dominating. The evening session turns out to be very good. Somehow everything gets resolved and the evening session which is run from 5 to 6 p.m. onwards on Sunday the 12th becomes extremely enjoyable and many solutions are found to the earlier problems. So if you are going to do business uh, relationships or business um, contacts, try to invite your business party and uh, you will find that you may even end up getting some good leads into business contracts. So the evening period makes you very happy, good to socialize personal areas or business or career areas. Monday the 13th is going to be a very lucky day for you. Very, very lucky at least in the morning and afternoon sessions. So you have a lot of progress that you can uh, bring about in the morning and the afternoon sessions at your place of work. You will get good news and you will be able to be supported by colleagues and if you are in business you are going to unexpectedly and very quickly get good business contacts or even good business contracts but the evening session and night session are not very steady and so watch out that from about 5 or 6 pm onwards these negative planets start to make you feel let down or disappointed or disappointing news may make you feel like that and also a lack of support is going to be seen, making you very unhappy. When you socialize or mix business and pleasure or go out with your colleagues or that you are going out with your loved ones, tell yourself you cannot afford to be argumentative. You cannot put your finger of blame pointing at anybody else. You cannot afford to be impulsive. And that way you can make your evening session just as good as you want it to be. Tuesday the 14th is a very good day for you. It starts off very well in the morning session at work or if you're in business, good news coming in the morning session. The afternoon session also just as good <coughs> and you do extremely well in the afternoon session bringing along good news that comes for business as well. If you're looking for romance, it's a very good day to try your luck and make your phone call in the morning and afternoon sessions and you can see that you are being obliged very nicely and that you're going to be in an area where a romance may start very nicely. The evening session also does well. Well, the morning and afternoon session has got very fast planets, so things move very fast. The evening session slows down, but it is still very good for you. So be more patient in waiting for things to develop the way you want when socializing. Go out with your loved ones, invite your colleagues if you want, uh, go out with your colleagues and if you are in business, no harm mixing business and pleasure and that way you will be able to get what you want all round. So a very good day which is Tuesday the 14th. Wednesday the 15th starts very well and Wednesday the 15th brings very good possibilities for you in career or business where good news awaits you, promotion or more money are all very possible, this kind of delightful news. If looking for romance, a good time for you to make a phone call to try your luck and get what you want on the morning and afternoon session. And if you're in business, you're also going to get very good business news as well. So a very lucky morning and afternoon period. The night time, there are some aggressive planets which may bring about a collision of minds or collision with words and this collision can bring two people to fall apart. So you must take the soft approach during the evening and night sessions of Wednesday the 15th. And with this soft approach, you'll be able to turn around the evening and the night period to become most enjoyable. 
don't want to be in charge most of the time. Let others take the leadership role as well. And you will find the evening session uh, doing well for you. There's some danger of accidents due to your anger. So try to control your anger and that will diffuse any accidents waiting to happen. Then we go to Thursday the 16th. Thursday the 16th for you is poised to be a difficult day. You can be let down, you can be played out. You can have an accident, you can have differences with others that can lead to even aggression against you. You can have things exposed where you become the victim as well in your area of career business or in love affair or in marriage. So a very difficult morning and afternoon session. The evening session seems to attack your ego, your position, your recognition and brings about blame upon you. So be careful, don't want to be in the limelight during the whole day, don't want to be singled out by showing yourself importance, don't want to take the leadership role and if you can not do these things which I've just mentioned, then you'll be able to lie low, be part of the scene, be part of the crowd and the finger of blame may not be directly pointed at you. So the whole day a bit difficult, try not to be arrogant, try not to be sneaky or to do things, plan things on a secret area or secret way and try to improve tolerance for others. And this way you can make the Thursday the 16th good enough for you. Now let's move to Friday the 17th. Friday the 17th for you in Gemini, is it? Yes, for you in Gemini. Becomes a very lucky day to begin with. But things are slow. And so you with a horoscope that likes to move very fast and get quick results may be frustrated as long-term planets on the move, but they are positive. So be patient for good news to develop in the morning and afternoon session. Whether in your career business or whether in love affairs, things will develop slowly for you and make you happy. Be patient. The evening session and the night session shows a bit of restlessness and the moodiness and a tendency to be very changeable in changing your mind or want, wanting to change what you want to do and the lack of focus is seen. So all this put together can bring frustration because others may find that you really don't know what you want and therefore you are in a position where you won't get what you want. So try to do the opposite, get your focus on what you really want in your night session and a late evening session and then approach them in a very soft manner and you'll be able to get what you want on uh, Friday the 17th during the evening and night session. Saturday the 18th shows uh, difficulties in approach that make you angry or that you make other people angry and it shows aggression is being used and being too pushy and demanding and you could be the one doing it or other people could be doing it to you and it also shows some danger of accidents there are many kinds of accidents in life. There's the physical accident, the emotional one and the mental one. And any of these areas, watch out if you are aggressive and pushy, this can happen to spoil your morning and afternoon sessions very much. Your evening session, I'm sorry to say, turns a little bit worse. So it's a day where you attract aggression or be aggressive. Then the evening session shows the disappointments and what you expect to get, you won't and therefore you feel miserable as well. Now the way to do is to approach everything in a very soft manner so that the approach, whatever approach you have, whether it's for love affair, whether it's for marriage areas, whether it's in career or business, that you don't provoke other people. It's the provocation part that builds up animosity against you. So take the soft approach and you'll be able to get away from a difficult Saturday, the 18th. And that's what I have to tell you coming from Gemini for the week of Sunday the 12th of February until Saturday the 18th of February. Do go to Facebook and uh, look me up and follow me and communicate with me and one day we'll be able to Skype so that I can answer your questions uh, regarding your general horoscope. Until then, thank you and goodbye.